come, brother? Where do you come from? Where do you come from? From Pumalanga. Yes. From Pumalanga, yes. Okay, God loves you because I saw many people, <laughs> all of you in your family were hated. Yes, that's true. Huh? That's true. All of you, you have been taken to this summer. That's who, true. Who initiated the whole family? All of them, huh? all of my family, they follow Sangoma. All of them, huh? all of them they worship idols, Sangoma, ancestors. You are under initiation. Yes, all of them. When I'm praying with people, I'm seeing initiations on you. Yeah. That's true. And you are trying to pray to come out. But that initiation holds your legs. Your legs here. Yes, because even now... Uh, that's why you see there's nothing moving. Yes. Huh? Yes, that's true. Because of what they did here. That's true. You understand? Yes. Something that happened while I was at school. Huh? It's something that happened, I think, in 2004. In fact, you people, all of you are supposed to be some of us. Yes. Huh? That's true. Because when I, when I took Jesus, uh, I started to work for Jesus Christ. And all of my family, they say, this man, this spirit that you are using is supposed to be a Sangoma. Because all of them, most of the, even my mother was a Sangoma. Even my your mother. sister is a Sangoma. That's what I say, all of you are supposed to be some of us. Yes, that's when true. When I was coming here, I saw initiations. That's true, that's true. So God wants to deliver you. Amen. To come out completely today. Move. Bring, stand in, let me stand. Sometimes you see dreams. And it's only bad dreams that come to pass. Yes, that's true. Yeah? That's With true. the spirit of a son of that's true. The spirit of a son mama does not show you good things. Yes. Pray this way. And, uh, many people at, at home, they will start to believe you. Yeah, Speak because your... I saw rejection. Amen. You are facing a rejection. Too much. Even the, when I started ministry, man of God, a lot of things was happening. My family rejected me. Everyone, they rejected Don't me. Don't worry. Yes. You'll be surprised people will start to understand you. Amen. And now God will start to bless you now. I receive. You I understand? Receive. Amen. Mm. Amen. I wish you were here for a long time. You people, you listen to people too much. Amen. Eish, that's true. Huh? That's true. You were supposed to be here a long time, but before you are listening to these people, try to tell you, hey, Macarena, he it's not a man of God. He's, hey, this, that, hey, Macarena, he did this. Look at yourself. Now. That's very true. Huh? That's very true. I was here before, but... Something happened and they, they blocked told you me. many things. Yes, that's true. And this thing now, it's like evil spirit working on them to stop you. That's For true. You, to, you, you wanted to come, but it was difficult. Last year on Chanawar, I was here on the, on huh? the first year, first time last year, Chanawar. Uh -huh. I was here, I wanted to, God pushed me to come and submit. But a lot of things happened. People, those are, I, I won't say the church. But I, I was submitting another it's church. Listening to people. Yes. When you listen to people, they will tell you things that will make demons to enter. That's true. If you just hear, I'm telling you the truth today. Amen. If you just hear people say, this man of God is not man of God, run away from such people. Amen. Amen. You hear me? Yes, sir. Because a man of God needs God. Amen. You just need God. So now they are trying to change what you believe in. Amen. Once you change what you believe in, demons will enter you. There's no way. Jesus. That's what Amen. happened. That's why everything is scattered. So it goes back to the same spirit of a Sangoma. Amen. Mm. Amen. A Sangoma is not supposed to see people in a group. Like yourself, you are gathering people in a group now. And you are becoming a Sangoma. They must come to you one by one. No church. One by one. So you will go in there. That's why you have to lose everyone. Amen. So Amen. You will see now when you go back there, people will be happy for you. Jeez. Others will come and say they need prayer. Amen. Now, God will give you revelations. That will come to pass now. 
I receive. So, God bless. That's, that's true, that's true, I confirm it. Because most of the people who are coming to me, some of them, they want to use me as like a Sangoma. They come like they want to consult like I'm a Sangoma. As hence, I'm a man of God. So that's why I'm telling you. Man. Amen. That's true. Because I don't know you, I'm telling you what you know about the issue of uh, your family, the whole family. Supposed to be uh, Sangomas, all of them. And now God chose you. Amen. But now you allow people. Once people tell you something in your ear, God will never speak again. I, w I once told one, my, one of my sons in Canada, I said, when I was in the church like this, when we are busy worshiping God, people are coming to say, Pastor, watch out, watch out, watch out. I said, ah, what is this now? Ah, wala, wala, wala. I said, ah, what is this now? In the service, you pastors here, you're not supposed to be informed in the ear by the time of service. Somebody must write note. If it's important, note must be written and brought to you like this. Somebody must not come to your ear and say, wala, wala, wala. What, what, what about God now? And that person might be blocking your ear. I'm sure you understand what I'm saying. And today, the man of God located you. Can you tell us the prophecy you received and also confirm it? Uh, the man of God prophesied to me uh, with the spirit of ancestors in my family, which is true, yes. My sister is a Sangoma, and my mother was a Sangoma also. And everyone in my family, they believe in ancestors. So as a man of God allocated me that they see the spirit of ancestors, which is true, very, very, very true. Yes, and I confirm it, the prophecy was true. Indeed, it was 100% true. And he also mentioned the fact that uh, this spirit is making you to dream, to have dreams, and the dreams that come to pass are bad dreams. Can you also tell us about that? Yes, uh, it is true, as the man of God said, because some of the things, more especially when, when there is something bad that is going to happen in my family, this thing will come to me also, and I will see it because it's using me as a, as a man of God to say it, that the spirit is coming to me, which is true, and it shows me the bad dream all the time. It attacking me all the time. Yes, it is true. And what can you tell us? One dream that you had that was bad and that came to pass. Actually, there are a lot of them, but uh, I will say. It. Before my grandfather uh, passed away, I saw his death, I saw everything. They told me that my grandfather passed away and my brother was stabbed and taken to prison. I saw it, the thing before it happened on the 31st, that my brother will be stabbed and taken to prison. Yes, that is true. I saw it. Everything that's going to happen in my family, a lot of things, I saw it before it happened. And the man of God also mentioned the fact that you were supposed to be here a long time ago. And also the fact that people come to you like they are going to a Sangoma. How would people come to you? Yes, uh, as I'm saying, I'm a man of God. Yes, I'm having a ministry. So some of the people, when they see the way God is doing, they, they use, they, they're using the same way. The spirit of the Sangoma. They, 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 when they look at me, they, look, they see me like, like I'm a Sangoma. So that's what they do. All the time they come to me, they come like they want to consult their problems. Not like, it's not like they're coming to the man of God. It seems like they're coming to a Sangoma. So that makes me to be sure that the prophecy was true. And for that, that I was supposed to be here for a long time ago. It is true because, uh, as I said, the last year, last year, last year, January, in the first service, I was here, and God pushed me too much to come here. But the, there are things that was happening uh, that it makes me to not come here. As the man of God mentioned, that there are people who speak, who's telling me something, influencing me bad things about the man of God, yet, which is true. People, they were speaking bad about the man of God and everything about the ministry. So I was afraid to come here because I wanted to please them. Because of, uh, but God pushed me to come here.